You're about to shift timelines and change your destiny forever. There is a new path opening up for you, a new beginning. The universe is about to give you a gift, and that gift is the chance of starting a new chapter in life because you deserve it. We will get into the details of this timeline shift by reading your coffee grounds, your cards, as well as the charms. There are no groups for this reading. This is a message for those of you who resonate with it and need it at this time. Let's get into the reading. I see that you have been doing some things to make this timeline shift possible. You have successfully detached from your past. You're no longer holding on to people and situations that have been holding you back from manifesting the life you want. I see that what you want is freedom. Your soul wants to be free, to live a peaceful life, surrounded by people that love you without any dramas or competition. I also see that you have successfully changed your mindset and the way you react to certain challenging situations. You're more focused on positivity and on your blessings. You have shifted your mindset, the way you see things and the way you think. Therefore, your reality is about to shift. You're about to enter a new timeline, like a portal, that you won't be able to believe how life can change for the better. At first, you're going to feel like it's a dream. I see you quantum jumping into a parallel reality. You see this timeline? There is nothing in between where you are now and where you're about to go. Either you have been trying quantum jumping, meditation, you have been manifesting, or without you knowing it, you have successfully quantum jumped. You did all the right things that require this quantum leap to happen. You worked according to the laws of the universe. You have manifested it. You put in the work to improve your life. And the last ingredient is shifting your mindset, which is the key for this quantum leap to happen. This is very specific, but I do see someone that you are interested in romantically. They are not the one. You share a past with this person. It's either a friend from the past or an ex. I don't see that you are destined to be together. The universe has put barriers that came between you to end this connection. They may have feelings for you too, but you are not destined to be together. They will hurt you again. I also don't see that they can be faithful. But on some level, you know this. And I'm seeing you walking away on your own, starting a new journey. You used to know a lot of people. It's okay to walk away from your past and start from scratch. On this new timeline that you're entering, I see you walking away from darkness. Not only are you going to change your reality, but you're also changing your habits and who you are. I see you coming out of your shell. Be ready for new routines, new places to go to, and new connections. I see you having new obligations, as well as more fun in this new timeline. I see someone playing a saxophone. Maybe you're going to a jazz concert, an event, or a music festival. When this opportunity presents itself to you, you should go. I see you making new connections and getting opportunities that will be beneficial to you. This is very specific, but if you have some musical talents, you should consider working on them. I see that you can even make this as a side hustle or a main income for some of you. You have a two-faced friend or family member here. I see them wearing a mask. They are about to be exposed. Their mask is going to fall off as soon as you shift timelines. They are not going to be happy for you and you will see through them how fake they are. This person might have a child or it could be that they have the maturity of a child. When this happens, just move on and simply ignore them. It's not worth arguing with them or anything. This person has never felt loved. You're about to get something that will make you very happy. This is something that your past self has wished for. I see you holding a key in your hands. This could be a new home or a degree, a certificate that will allow you to get your dream job. I see that you are about to move up in life. 
Everything that you have been through in the past was destined to happen to prepare you for this future. I see you being lifted up by your experiences, challenges that taught you and your strength of character. For some of you, this could be a new job that will open doors to financial freedom as well as social status. I see you making a deal with someone which confirms this message. You are about to sign a contract that will upgrade your life. You will be getting two opportunities at the same time. Two major positive events are about to happen to you. One is going to unlock the other. There is someone that really misses you. This is someone older than you with feminine energy. They could be a mother figure for some of you. I see a big distance between you and them. And this distance is getting bigger. You have evolved so much and are about to reach higher levels of success. But they stayed the same. Even their mindset is still the same. I see like they have planted roots. It's like they have planted themselves somewhere. They're attached to a specific area or a specific mindset and they can't change. You can't change them. They are who they are, but they really miss you. This distance was destined to happen. You needed it in order to grow. So don't feel bad about it. I see the universe offering you the moon as well as a new path, a path towards happiness. It's telling you that you're not alone and that you have a higher purpose. You're meant to change generational cycles and create a new tradition, a new mindset, a new way of life, a life that is focused on happiness and fulfilling a purpose. You have grown so much. Let's get more details with the cards. I'm going to be using my Oracle deck for this reading. If you like these cards, I've linked where you can get them in the pinned comment below. This is a confirmation that you are about to shift timelines. There is something that you believed will possibly never happen that is about to surprise you. This could be upgrading your life, making new connections on a soul level, or entering a new loving relationship. Some of you will be moving soon, a move to a new home or a move overseas. Expect positive surprises as darkness is clearing up the challenges are about to clear up. The worst is over. There is a new beginning for you on the horizon. This change is happening right now. You are at a time of transition. Spiritually, you are sailing towards a new timeline, and you are the one driving this ship. You are in control of your destiny because you have shifted your mindset. I see that you have already made a change. It's like you suddenly woke up and said, I had enough. You may be about to move to a new home or start a new job. If you haven't, it's time to make a change. Otherwise, this shift will take longer. And I see that right now, you are ready for this change. You have chosen the truth. You have chosen to stay true to yourself. You chose honesty over fakeness. I see that you have burnt bridges with some people because they have shown to you their true intentions. They have shown to you that they have been faking it all along. You'd rather be alone than surrounded by fake people. When it comes to your career, you are prioritizing doing what you love, no matter how much people judge. You are about to live a life in alignment with your soul and with your authentic self. This is specific, but this could also be when it comes to your looks. You may have noticed yourself recently going for a more natural look, embracing your natural beauty. You've been working on yourself. You may have been embracing solitude as well, getting away from distractions and focusing on yourself. You did something to shift timelines, whether you know it or not. Some of you may have done a spell or manifestation techniques. It's working. You're going to get what you want. You have also worked hard for this. It didn't come easy to you. Shifting your focus towards your goals towards positivity, gratitude, and mindfulness wasn't easy, 
but you did it. You're about to enter a timeline that will allow you to live a life in alignment with the frequency of love. If you have been feeling caged and buried in your current timeline, this new timeline that you are currently shifting towards is going to make you bloom like a flower. You're going to glow inside and out. You will be living in alignment with the frequency of love, surrounded by people and things that you love, being able to explore your passions and the things that you have felt deprived of in your current timeline. You paid your karmic debt and now you are about to get rewarded. Some people are going to be envious of you. You need to protect your blessings by keeping them private to yourself. Also, when you shift to this new timeline that is waiting for you, you are going to be in a place of love. So be careful of envy. Envy can bring you back to where you are now. Be careful of jealousy. Try to remember to keep this in mind. The cards are also warning you of jealous people. You need to stay away from them. Jealousy is a strong feeling that can quickly bring us down to hate. Let's get more details with the charms. This timeline shift is going to happen very soon and sooner than you expect. Don't allow anyone to be in control of your life. Don't put your fate and happiness in someone else's hands. You have been blessed with strength, capabilities and a strong intuition that you can give yourself the happiness and the life you want. This timeline shift will happen around month number 6 or 7 or for some of you the number 6 and 7 have a strong significance when it comes to this reality shift. Luck is by your side. For some of you, this reality shift may happen around the Leo season, which is July and August, and the Libra season, which is September and October. Some of you may be into music or practice a musical instrument, or maybe you have a good singing voice. If this is the case, then you are being encouraged to pursue this passion and give it more of your time. We have a mirror charm. The mirror symbolizes truth in spirituality. You know what you truly want and desire. And on this new timeline, you are going to live in harmony with your truth. It's going to feel right. You're being called to stay focused on the destination. Stay focused on your goal, how you want your life to be. Don't stop manifesting and working towards it. You are about to receive an email or a letter in your mailbox that will speed up the timing for this reality shift. It's a message that is going to make you very happy. I see an approval and an opportunity for a renewal. Some of you may have some family members or a specific family member or a close friend who may be slowing you down. I see you on the edge of a portal that will allow you to reality shift, but this person is trying to keep your attention away from what is meant for you. They can't prevent you from getting what you want, but they can slow you down. Be careful. Don't give them your energy and don't listen to their advice. They could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They can see your shine. The clock is ticking. There will only be a matter of time for you to enter this reality shift and change your reality forever. There is one last thing that you need to let go of. It starts with the letter W, and it could be worry. Worrying too much can block your manifestations. You're being encouraged to take this opportunity to shift your destiny and detach from the things that may be holding you back. You're about to receive an opportunity to start working or studying in a city. This opportunity will take your career to the next level. The city could start with an L for some of you. Your career will be successful once you take this opportunity. However, you're being encouraged to take it slow, especially in the beginning. Don't jump on the first career opportunity that you get. Weigh down your options. That's all I have for you. I hope you found this reading insightful. 
Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so. It will mean the world to me. I love you and see you in my next reading.